Hi, you're watching At The Bench with Norgen Biotech. Today, we will be demonstrating the step-by-step -step workflow for the Saliva Swab RNA Purification Kit, catalog number 69100. This kit offers fast and easy processing using a rapid spin column format. It allows for isolation of total RNA, from large RNA down to microRNA, with no phenol or chloroform extractions required. The isolation is very sensitive and linear, down to a few cells or viral copies without the need for carrier RNA. RNA purified using this kit is suitable for a variety of downstream applications, including small RNA sequencing. To collect saliva samples that will be used in this procedure, consider Norgen's saliva RNA collection and preservation devices. Or, if you are working with preserved swabs, consider Norgen's total nucleic acid preservative tubes. Both of these products are fully compatible with this kit. Upon opening the kit you will find a detailed product insert, mini spin columns, collection tubes, elution tubes, wash solution A, solution WN, lysis buffer A, and elution solution A. And you as the user will need to provide 1x PBS pH 7.4 and 96 to 100% ethanol. To prepare your saliva samples, transfer 250 microliters of preserved saliva sample into a 2 ml tube. Add 1x PBS to make up the volume to 400 microliters. Add 400 microliters of lysis buffer A directly to the previous mix. Mix by vortexing for 10 seconds. Add 400 microliters of 96 to 100% ethanol to the lysate. Mix by vortexing for 10 seconds. Assemble a spin column with one of the provided collection tubes. Apply up to 600 microliters of the lysate with the ethanol onto the column. And centrifuge for one minute at 14,000 RPM. Discard the flow through and reassemble the spin column with its collection tube. Depending on your lysate volume, repeat these steps as necessary to bind the remaining lysate volume. Apply 400 microliters of solution WN to the column and centrifuge for one minute at 14,000 RPM. Discard the flow through and reassemble the spin column with its collection tube. Apply 400 microliters of wash solution A to the column and centrifuge for one minute at 14,000 RPM. Discard the flow through and reassemble the spin column with its collection tube. Wash the column a second time with wash solution A. Spin the column for two minutes in order to thoroughly dry the resin and discard the collection tube. Place the column into a fresh 1.7 milliliter elution tube provided with the kit. Add 50 microliters of elution solution A to the column. Centrifuge for two minutes at 2000 RPM. Followed by one minute at 14,000 RPM. The purified RNA sample may be stored at negative 20 degrees Celsius for a few days. It is recommended that samples be placed at negative 70 degrees Celsius for long-term storage. RNA that has been purified using this kit can be used in RTQPCR, next generation sequencing, viral detection, and more. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more like this, please like and subscribe to our channel. And remember to follow us on all of your favorite social media platforms. See you next time at the bench.